Hello everyone, I am Eva Dedix Chevron Baggage and I am with me is my beloved wife. My name is Evangelist City Lalo Badejo. We warmly welcome you to our YouTube channel, Chevron Badejo, formerly known as Actuality TV of Idiot's Nation. With a great joy and anticipation, we warmly invite you to our YouTube channel. On our channel, we are dedicated to bringing you spiritually edifying and entertaining content. Not just to entertain you, but to enrich your spirit soul. We invite you to subscribe to our YouTube channel where you will find a treasure truth of spiritual insight and teachings. By watching, liking, and sharing our video, to join the community of people that spread the gospel and inspire others in the journey of faith. Together, we can build a bridge between entertainment and enlightenment. So, dear friends, we humbly urge you to join us on this spiritual adventure. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Watch our videos. Share, share with your loved, loved ones. God, God bless you. Better, you know, be careful of high blood pressure. Eh? Which high blood pressure are you talking about? Is it the one that is there already or a new one? <sighs> just, just, just be calm. Eh? Just take it easy. Ah, oh, God. Oh, my shadow. Thank you. 
Dans leur but in Jesus' name. I do not know you. I bow to the name and never you. Demon, <laughs> you demon of falsehood. I repeat in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Is this 
one. The King Eri. <laughs> well, the Lord sent me here. He gave me your name and your location. Are you serious? Yes. He told me when I get here, he would tell me the reason why I'm here. We meet in church every day, but we've never really spoken. Mm, Please true. come. True. God is good. No. Let me show you where I go. Don't here. come here. Oh, okay. Don't okay. come inside. Don't open the oh, door. God, just go away. Just don't like come that. into this house. Just like that. Go. Oh don't come into this house. I can feel power. I can feel it. I can feel the power. I can feel it. Don't open the door. No! Silence! Silence, everyone! Quiet! I command you, spirit, uncover your ears and listen in the name of Jesus. Who oh, sent you here? <laughs> the commander sent me to deal with you. Do you know my name? I know you well. You are a general in the Lord's army. Mm. If that be the case, are you ready to fight or ready to surrender peacefully? I surrender. I rebook you in the name of Jesus. I command every one of you in there, get out in the name of Jesus. Amen. No, 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 don't, 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 don't touch it. I, I think the one who spoke with me is still there. Mm. Others have left. Now listen to me. You power demon, you foul spirit, I command you out and never return in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Is she okay, sir? It is settled. It is settled. It is settled. It is settled. What, what's her name? Oni Consola. Oni. Oni Consola. The devil is a bad devil. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the devil is a bad devil. Mm -hmm. uh, don't worry, she's fine now. She's <laughs> fine. Let's let's go to the living room. We have a lot of things to talk about. Yes, we have a lot of things. Is, to talk about. is she okay? <laughs> she's fine. Ah, She's fine. Thank you, Jesus. We have a lot. Let's let's go. Let's go. Thank you, Jesus. No worries. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, ye consola. Let's go. Let's go. We have a lot to discuss. Hey, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
of Niger. Prince, trouble is brewing in Nigeria. It is spreading to other countries in Africa and to the entire world. Our captives are being set free. Our plans and purposes are defeated. Our strongholds are being pulled down. What do you have to say to this? Prince of Niger. Your royal high priest, Nigeria is the trigger of the whole Africa. My lord, whatever happens in Nigeria affects the whole Africa. And subsequently, my lord, the whole world. Prince of Niger, how could you let this happen under your watch? I got a signal blinking from a particular man of God named Mark. A captain in the Lord's army. There were 15, my lord. We are succeeded in bringing down 11. But this man and three others have been resistant and strong. Many legions have been destroyed by them. We have labeled them as the untouchables, my lord. My lord. I counsel. We leave them. Stop, Prince of Niger. Host of warriors, appear. I have a contract. Anyone who fulfills this contract will be crowned Prince of Niger in his name. Go, Commander! I am putting a contract on Captain Mark. You are scared of a mortal man made from ordinary mud? A mere mortal whose life is in the breath of his nostrils? Your Majesty, how dare the country! How do you hope to accomplish this? Over the centuries, I studied humans critically, especially Christians, and I've come to realize they are susceptible to the sins they committed before accepting Christ. I was the power demon attached to Captain Mark. When he was a teenager, I know him very well. I will exploit his weakness, my lord. But do you? Interim Prince of Niger. If you succeed in winning the soul of this one, I will give you the crown. 
and your new position shall be validated. Doctor. How are you? I'm fine. You asked me to see you before going off duty. Yes, 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 you did. Uh, I just finished a very difficult operation right now. And um, I'm very, very tired. Very tired. So I'll come back later then. Uh, no, 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 it's fine. You can, you can have a seat, you can have a seat. Uh, Nostera. Um, Nostera, I... <clears throat> I can't, um, I can no longer pretend, okay? Uh, I, I notice your seductive heart and I don't think I can pretend anymore. Mm. And I can't fake it. Yeah, I can't. But can, can you quickly check anyone, if anyone's at the door? Sure. Uh, We are completely safe. We can actually close the door and lock the keys if you're scared, you know? Um, no, 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 it's fine. You can open the door wide. Come, come on, open the door. Open it wide enough. Good, good, good. Then you can have a seat. No, no, don't worry, it's fine. Just have a seat. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, sit down. Nostara. Yes? I believe you know I am married and I am a child cop. <laughs> and so what? That's what makes you so sweet. Mm -hmm. That's not strange. And um, do you have a conscience? Because I'm very sure you know that um, sex outside marriage is a sin. And um, wait, do you believe in life after death? Are you aware that there is heaven for the righteous and there is hell for, uh, for the sinners? Well done, sir. You try. Very soon, you will say, For God so loved the world. <laughs> sir, I am a preacher's kid. 
and nothing you say can move me. I know the Bible more than you can ever think. So many people have tried to convert me, but they failed woefully. So even if you quote 100 scriptures, it's going to bounce back at you. Why are you so difficult? Hey, why? You really want to know, doctor? I have a problem. Oh, a problem? Yes. When you can show me the evidence that heaven and hell exist, then I will accept Jesus Christ. You know, um, in this profession, I have witnessed so many deaths. And so have I. No, 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 no. When did you start practicing as a nurse? Two and a half years. Um, you've seen some deaths, but you have not seen anything. Mm. Listen, my dear, in my years of practice, I have seen a lot. See, uh, uh, some die peacefully. And at the point of death, they radiate light that is out of this world. Tara, the other set of people died with fear all written all over them. Tara, they scream and their death is always a horrible sight. And I have since discovered that those who die peacefully, they are Christian, believers, child of God. <laughs> My dear, the news is, they have concrete assurance of where they are going. Oh, uh, it's time for word round. Um, can I can I pray with you before you leave? If you desire, sir. <sighs> Father, I commit your daughter Dara into your hands. Lord. Please touch her. Let the light of the gospel shine upon her and grant her a request. Oh Lord, show her. Grant her request. Show her heaven and hell so that she may believe that you exist, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Atu wana mi, oke kele mi yeri, kele mi be mi, aziza kanji azazu, konye ma ya maraya, atu wana mi, oke kele mi yeri, kele mi be mi, aziza kanji azazu, konye ma ya maraya, atu wana mi, Okay, can let me hear you. Can let me be me. Aziza Kanja Zanzuzu. Gonye Maya Maraya. Gonye Maya Maraya. Gonye Maya Maraya. What you to great? What do you seek? Okay, so the world is on the unit. Without performing, you should back to back. Mothers of the universe. Who am I to disrespect the others and break rules? I only summon you as a result of an urgency. Speak! Speak. Speak. 
We don't, we don't have, have time, time for trivia. Mothers, the great one has given me a contract to quench a raging fire in Nigeria. Nigerians have been known to be a clock in a wheel of our advancement in Africa and the whole world. They pray, they set loose our captives. Many of our agents have been destroyed, demobilized, and demoralized. One of them has been marked for an extermination. I, Waju, have accepted the contract. What do I do? Talk boasting about their achievements. Tell us about the one you talked about, Waju. Murder. He's not even a pastor or a bishop. He's just an ordinary deacon in the church. His name is Mark Benson. Ha! Ah! No! Don't tell me you are scared. An ordinary man whose life is in the grip of his nostrils. How dare you talk to us in such despicable manner? We fear, we fear no one, Wajud. We, we cannot, cannot help, help you. you. But, but we, we can, can refer you, you to those, those who can. can. <laughs> the the assassins. assassins. Yes. yes. They, they fear, fear no one. one. They will they joyfully will execute, execute this mission. mission. And, and bring, bring him, him down. down. Great yes, mothers, mothers of the of universe. universe. Mothers, mothers we are. Yeah. Mothers, mothers will be. be. I welcome you all, the dark assassins, to my kingdom. As you must have heard, I have been anointed as the ancient prince of Niger, and I have an urgent mission at hand. This mission will validate my new position, and I cannot afford to fail. That's why I call you to help me execute this mission, Dark Assassins. What would you have us do? We are the fearless ones. We respect no one. Good. I'm pulling a contract on Captain Mark. I want to have him checkmated. How can you help me execute this assignment since we all know his weakness from teenage? As you know, we have our agents in us pairs of life. One of these agents is close to his location. She is a shrewd agent that can execute any mission with precision and accuracy. We will fortify her and prepare her for this Raf, my dear husband, hello, hello, please who died, who died, did you just tell me, because for the past three days in this house, you've been mourning, I've been cooking in this house, and you've refused to eat, you've been clutching on that Bible, day and night as if it is your life, eh, tell me what is wrong, <laughs> Mr. Ralph, what happened at Dickens Harris? 
हैं बिकॉज सिंस यू कैम बैक फ्रॉम दियर हाउस यू हैव बीन किडनी टू योर सेल्फ यू एक्टिंग डेफ एंड डोम ओके आई नो वॉट टू डू it is high time i called him and asked him because i can't put up with this any longer look at my food and what were you telling the truth mr harry the truth that since you came back from their house after the delivery session of their daughter you have been keeping to yourself and i will also tell him that since you came back you've had scars on your face and on your necks can you listen to yourself So you want to accuse them of causing me harm. <laughs> Oni, please don't look for my trouble this night. Please let me be. Lord, have mercy. No pure mercy on me. No mercy. Mercy, Lord, have mercy on me. Sister Oyin, hmm. you are now a child of God, and now that you have given your life to Christ, you know you have to do away with your old lifestyle. You have to do away with your old friends, even your dressing too. Yes, it might not be that easy, but with the help of God, and um, let's open our Bibles to Psalm one one nine, verse one o five. Thy word is a lamp unto my feet, and a light unto my path. So now you have to take time to study God's word. You have to take time to pray. You have to take time to fellowship with others. Because the more you fellowship with others, you'll be able to learn from more people. You'll be able to know what people are going through and how to even get your way. I pray that God is going to help you in Jesus' name. So I want to teach you a song. It goes thus: Things are different now. Things are different now. Something happened to me. Something happened to me when I gave my life. When I gave my life to Jesus. To Jesus. Things are different now. Something happened to me when I gave my life to Jesus. saying that to me. That's not fair. My sister, it's true. Possessed people are not always totally delivered. I heard she attacked Pastor Laf and even wounded him. Don't you notice that the choir is now scanty? Since she refused to leave the choir, people started leaving. Nobody wants to be associated with a possessed sister. Joy, why are you like this? You just tell me, why are you like this? Even if she's still possessed, you as a believer, what have you been doing for her instead of praying for her as a believer? But tell me, what have you been doing instead of praying for her? You are busy preaching the devil's gospel, spreading unfounded rumors up and down. I beg, what can go? I will not be a partaker of this. I say leave. Then if you will not, maybe I will. Ha! Huh?
What? What is it again? Why are you so cold? You know I don't like it when you wake me up like that. I don't like it. You already know I won't be able to sleep again. I, I have prayer meetings in the morning. I, I don't understand you. If I don't need you, if I don't miss you, will I just wake you up just for nothing? Why are you doing this, Anita? Wait, so that prayer meeting is much more important to you than me? If you needed me, then you should have come earlier. Anita, if I have come earlier, you would have created another excuse to, to dismiss me also. What is going on? I noticed your change lately. Anita, what is going on? I don't understand you anymore. Okay. Oh yeah, come. Come and do what you have to do and let me sleep. Come now, come. Oh yeah, do what you want to do. Are you not coming again? You are not doing again. Oh yeah, come and do it. This is so easy. Mission accomplished. I will go and finish it. Hold it. I say hold it. Don't you dare touch the anointed man of God or harm his prophet. Is God unrighteous? Will he go against his word? In his word, he said, let not the sun go down on your rod. But he left his wife in the bedroom in anger and came into the sitting room. This man stand accused because he just lost it after the lady in his office. Your corrupt sense of reasoning never ceases to amaze me. Have you forgotten that this man here is not your servant, but the servant of the Most High? And he alone has the right to declare him guilty or guiltless. How do you mean? <laughs> You still don't understand, you foul spirit. I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy, and compassion on whom I will have compassion. It is therefore not of him that will it or run it, but of God that shows mercy. Jesus, Jesus, oh Lord, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord I'm sorry, Lord I'm sorry, I'm sorry Lord, I'm, 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 I'm sorry Lord, I'm, Lord have mercy on me, I'm on the blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, Lord, I'm, Lord, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, Lord. Lord, I'm sorry. I'm, please forgive me. Please, I'm sorry, Lord. I'm so sorry.
Yeah, good evening, my sister. How are you? <clears throat> oh, uh, Dr. Mark. I love my pastor. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, sir. Yeah, well done. It's good to uh, see you, sir. Yeah, thank you. Um, I asked you to see me and you didn't you didn't wait. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Pastor Rav. I am I'm, I'm so sorry. It was a mistake. Okay, okay. Let, let's go into my office. No, 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 Dr. Mark. Let's talk in my car. Uh, you see, I'm not part of what I want to talk to you about. Oh. And I don't want anyone to drop on us. So let, let's talk in my car. All right. You see, Dr. Mark, since that day in Dickin Harry's house, I've never been myself. I've never been so disgraced in my life. I was humiliated. I feel like dying. I couldn't cast out that demon. But you did. Mm -hmm. The demon obeyed you. But disgraced me. How come? You are my convert. Pastor Ralph. Are you... Are you sincerely saying that your ways with the Lord is straight? Or are you sure that the presence of the Lord has not left you, sir? Hmm. Dr. Mark, at this point, I can't hide anything. There are two ladies I met on social media. Initially, it was harmless shots. But later, it degenerated into immoral shots. We later melt, and I fed flat for two of them. And my spiritual life was sucked dry. Since then, I lost his presence. <sighs> um, Pastor, I... I know I got saved through you. And I, I really appreciate it, sir. Sincerely, I will not... I will not blame you of anything or judge you, sir. I will... I will definitely save the way the Spirit of the Lord placed in my mind. Sir, uh, Second Kings revealed that Elijah and Baal the prophet went to the mountain for a competition. Hmm. And the competition is just all about uh, uh, whosoever uh, the gods answered by fire is hmm. the God. Hmm. You know, Elijah discovered that the stone at the altar has been pulled down so he decided that the stone need to be put together. The altar of the Lord need to be rearranged. And after that, Elijah picked the stones and arranged it, placed them in order and mm. call upon God and fire fell. Sir, uh, what I'm trying to say is I believe so much that if you put your life in order, if you put your life back in order, sir, the fire will fall again. I believe that, sir. <sighs> the fire will fall again. Listen, the fire will fall again. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. This is well, sir. Dick and Harry, sir. Yes, sir. How are you, sir? Oh, yes, sir. How is mommy and um, Oi? Hey, Pat, I called you because of Oi. Oh. Oi is working with wives again. Uh -uh. I have won and I'm sweating how much she feels to change. And I started showing her place. <laughs> this girl. <laughs> so she, she she really the last time i spoke with her i asked her how is her spiritual life going 
She said she's, she's growing steadily. So she deceived me. Uh, sir, please tell her to put a call to me right away. Thank you very much, sir. Yes, sir. You do, sir. Thank you, sir. Ah, uh -uh. Dara. Please sit. What happened? What's why didn't you get? Please, please help me, doctor. Please. What's going on? Help me find Christ, please. Jesus, Jesus, use my life. Use my life. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for Jesus. redeeming me back to new life. For redeeming me to a new life. Oh, thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. I am your new son. I am your new child. I am your new child. I am your new child. Accept me, Lord. Accept me, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Please, please sit down, sit down, sit down. Thank you. No. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. No, it's there. Thank you, see, you so much. You see, um, now that you give your life to Jesus, you, you will have to do away with all your old life and sinful life with friends, okay? You have to dedicate yourself to Jesus completely and work out your salvation with your training. Okay? Uh, see, all you need to understand is whosoever that is in Christ Jesus is a new creature. All things are passed away. New things begins new. Okay? I, I know the Lord is going to help you and you will have a better life. Amen. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you so much. Um, what church do you have then? Yes, uh, Power in Time Church. Yes. Okay, um, I would love to be attending your oh, church. Oh, that, that's, that's great. That's good news. I actually, I would like to work with God. Mm, thank you, Jesus. Thank you so much, Doctor. It is I very feel this peace. Hallelujah. That's the Spirit of the Lord. Thank you. It is well, it is well. I trust the Lord is going to help you. Hmm. Hmm. This is serious. Huh. You are treading on a dangerous ground. I'm even short of words. Because you are not like this before. Huh. When did this start? Two weeks. Huh. It all started two weeks ago. Honestly, I'm scared because I don't even understand my own actions. I discover I have begun to repel at the slightest touch. Sometimes I fake sleep and fake illness just so I could be left alone. Last night we had a quarrel. And for the first time, my husband left the bedroom to sleep in the sitting room. Wow. Midi, I'm scared. 
Oh my God. Then, I don't take some things with levity. No, you know me. You know if I were you, I will handle these things in prayer. You know, the strange thing is, each time I try to pray about it, I just feel this weakness all over. And then I slip off. <laughs> wow. Well, you know one thing? Things like this has never happened to me. Because, <laughs> me, I don't take such things with levity, you know me. Because even if my husband did not ask for it, I will definitely ask him. For the past three weeks that my husband has been away, in fact, I've not been finding it easy at all. I've been trying to take some precautions, like I don't allow a male to come to my house, neither do I do that. I don't allow any undue touch. In fact, I know that my body is the temple of the Lord and his sanctuary. When is your husband coming back? Well, my husband will be coming back next week. I can't wait to have my honey back. In fact, this year you should call for serious attention. We need to raise an altar urgently. Baby. Hi. Oh, oh man of God. Good evening. How are you? Hi, darling. How are you doing? I'm fine. All right, sir. How are you doing, ma? I'm fine. Okay, I'm good. And how was your day? Very well, then. You're welcome, sir. Absolutely. Ah, are you leaving already? <laughs> it's okay. Okay, darling. Yeah. Let me just see you. So, see me well to your husband when he comes back. Honey, how was your day? Oh, very well, thank you. Um, I hope you remember to bring my friend's recommended one. Oh. Oh, so sorry. Let's see if I got. Um, Gloria. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, help me to what I give you. All right. Um, help me to bring it. Okay. All right, sir. Uh, thank you, dear. Yes, sir. Thank you. <clears throat> Honey. Yeah. Why did you look at her like that? Who's that? Gloria, of course. <clears throat> and how did I look at her? I saw the way you looked at her. And you said, my dear. <sighs> okay. So, if I look at her anyhow or somehow, or call her dear, Anita, what's that? Oh, who caused it? Who caused it? You, of course. Definitely, you caused it. Do you know how many times you have you have denied me of of my conjugal rights, and and you left me in the cold every night? Come on, Anita. Come on, please. Ha! Hey, hey, honey. Just hear the words that is that is coming out of your mouth. You. You were looking at her in a very, in a lustful way, and you called her my dear. And then you, you just called me by my name. You just called me Anita. Uh -huh. Hey, hey. Honey, you are changing. You are changing, and I don't like it. Really? Like, seriously? Changing? Who is changing? No, no, Anita, who is changing? You have changed completely. You have, you, you've totally changed. I don't understand you anymore. Say, this is please. If you don't mind, can you remove the, 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 the being in your own eyes before you remove the, the speck in my own eyes? This is, be careful. Okay? Talking to me like I see who, who caused it. You, of course. 